welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am Kat. On this channel, we do all things spooky, Halloween-y. We toss in some nostalgia for our spooky 90s kids' hearts. Keep it spooktastical all year long. So if that sounds like something you'd be interested in, please consider hitting the subscribe button and hanging out with us. I have officially, I think, capped off the Halloween Bath & Body Works purchases so far. I say that and then like every few days I go back on the website and get more stuff. <laughs> Cause you know, they keep on putting more stuff out and I have no self control, you know that. So cause we're gonna keep doing this. I was thinking I would slice it up from like Halloween stuff and then like folly stuff just to like kind of divvy it up a little bit. It's all in that realm of like cozy, best stuff to put on when it's raining and like it's just like a cold day or a cooler night or morning and like that's my inspiration for everything I got really here like take a bath or a shower and like just make a, a moment like a moment like a mom moment or just like a human being moment that's just like what I live for so let's get into I think maybe the Halloween stuff first and then we'll do the fall so I placed an order online for the Halloween stuff and they were all released and I honestly did not buy a lot of the actual decor. I noticed that I was like leaning more towards like bath stuff and like lotions and stuff like that. First off, I'll go with my favorite thing I got. I think, I think it's actually the most expensive thing I got and I really didn't want to spend much. It's this candy apple cauldron candle that it's mysterious green apples, simmering sugar and crystallized bergamot. And it's got this amazing lid. This is the really cool part about it. I want to be able to see if you... See if you can see the lady in there. Oh, you're just gonna see my, there we go, there she is. I saw this when it was released, like on like the leaked stuff way back in I wanna say May or something. And I was like that, I know I need that. So this was like the first thing I had to get. Also like this packaging on this is just so beautiful with like the little kind of witchy crystal eyes, like little eyes and hands and star stars and right up my alley. So this was a necessary evil um because it was 37 dollars for one candle <laughs> then onto soaps i got this little perfect pumpkin i think these were on sale online so i didn't spend more than like four dollars on them the design on it cute with like the little eyeballs in between the skeleton hands i liked that packaging then for hand soaps wicked vanilla woods this one has another little skeleton hand but this time it's got like the little snake all around it it's cute i think these were four dollars at the time magical vanilla glowing amber wood and enchanted pink pepper i think this is one of my favorite halloween scents if not like all the time ever of bath and body works it's wicked vanilla woods and i have it and like i'm about to show you i have the ones from last year or the year before that i have now i have the new ones too because i i use it all year long so it's not like a to me it's like a very like normal I don't know I guess it's just an all the time like vanilla woodsy smell so it goes for all the time if that's your bag and I got the wicked vanilla woods in the hand cream or the body cream this one I think that was 18 but it you know everything wasn't on sale that day then the wicked vanilla woods in the body wash I got like the whole set um, I do, I actually didn't get the lotion, technically that's like one other thing, but this is like a little snake in front of a tree, I guess. It's kind of pretty with the, the holographic tree on there. And then I really was super excited for the ghoul friend body care stuff, because I'm a huge fan of the, that scent. So I went with the ghoul friend lotion. And then of course the body wash in the same scent, ghoul friend, and this one, I don't think I said the names or the, the fragrance notes yet. Dark strawberry. Dark, dark strawberries, ghostly peony, and spine ching, chingling. Spine chingling. Spine chilling. Citrus. I'm annoyed with myself. I got a little body care because there was like a gift. I think they did like a free travel thing, but I just love it. For some reason, it reminds me of bubbles or like a doll that I had when I was a kid. So once again, this is goes back to the nostalgia, my nostalgia obsession, and reminds me of something when I was a child <laughs> that I loved. So it holds a special place in my heart. <laughs> then I got a couple pocket back holders, antibacterial holders, I'm not really sure what to call them. I saw this one on the leak, leaked pictures also, knew I had to have one. It's like this little light up ghosty. I do have 
the sequin one, I, if I can find a picture, I'll, I'll put it up of last year, but it's like a, I don't know, a different, different version of him, I guess, today, this year. And he lights up, I don't know if you can see it, kind of bright in here, and he glows in the dark. And I think that's really cute. Let me just, I, I want to add like a little video of him glowing in the dark because he just is super adorable. And we'll just like, I think you charge him like outside. And then when you bring him inside in the dark, he just glows super bright. That was $9.95. And then this little cutie I was looking for everywhere. I did not see him on the leaked things at all. So I don't know where he came from. He was like a surprise. <sighs> There's a little dog hair on it. $6.95. Just this cute little ghosty whipped cream. And like coming out of a little pumpkin mug. Like how cute, like holding a cinnamon stick. Are you kidding? Needed, needed. And then actually back before anything was released, I saw this in one of my Bath and Body Works stores that I have kind of locally. I was looking for this and I was like very, very happy that I actually found this. I don't really put in the little vent fragrance things in my car. I kind of just want like my car to smell like my car. So I don't really add anything to it, but I just wanted to put this out just cause it's beautiful. <laughs> I'll put them out in my car just to make my car a little witchy spooky vibes, which I love. Okay. Now onto the folly stuff. <laughs> There's two of these, two of these. Okay. Let's start. Let's, we shall begin. So Classic caramel pumpkin swirl. Had to get her. It's luscious caramel, ground cinnamon, rich brown sugar, creamy vanilla. This is like the one I reach for a lot in like late August, September, all throughout October, November. Like I just keep this out. And so I needed a restock of this guy. And then another one that I just always reach for in like October, November. I feel like it's very folly is pumpkin clove. And I also super loved this design and the packaging with like the little fall village and pumpkins and like a little pumpkin patch. And of course it's very clovey, very, it's clove buds, ground cinnamon, pinch of nutmeg and fresh pumpkin. That's like the quintessential fall candle for me. So we have another one of these now. And then I don't know if you saw pretty quick, Stranger Things had a line with Bath and Body Works for like a second. And <laughs> I needed this Hopper's Coffee one because I'm not normally like a coffee candle girl, but the way they sold it was like just kind of simple black coffee with like cream. So they say roasted coffee grounds, tonka bean, splash of half and half. And it says mornings are for coffee and con contemplation. So it's really <clears throat> like I just picture this on like a Sunday morning with like actual coffee being made. And just kind of enhancing the coffee smell. I don't know. I I envisioned this when I when I bought it. So had to get this guy. So then for as for folly hand soaps, I had to grab this sugar, lemon, and spice. It's kind of like for me, I'm putting this out like in August. So it's like transitional scent for me. So I'm putting this in like probably my bathroom. Um, this one is lemon zest, fresh cardamom, and sugar ginger. Smells really fresh and clean. And then the, another popular one, cherry almond shortbread. So this will go in my kitchen probably. And it's vanilla shortbread, candied almond, and cherry. And it smells just like that. Very like pie scent, like that buttery pie smell with cherry. It's really nice. And then the last hand soap is pumpkin pecan waffles. Classic necessary one that I have to have in the collection for fall. It's maple syrup, golden waffles, and pumpkin spice. I love this candle and I actually have two that I, I in my like collection over here to my to my right. But I needed the hand soap so I had to grab that guy. And these are actually I got two of these. Um these I was looking for this somebody posted on like a uh, some sort of forum. <sighs> the fall and like Halloween lover for, forums and this is $7. It's a little apple cider apple cider antibacterial holder. It's got the freaking apple and like a little nutmeg and caramel on the whipped cream, like a little smiley face, $7. What? I got one for me and one for my sis because I know she'll appreciate this. <laughs> you know, Carolyn, if you watch our Halloween tour of vlogs, she was very happy to know that I got her one of these. <laughs> then we got the pumpkin swirl cake lotion. 
the amount of lotion I've collected in the last like two weeks and like I'll never get through them. Like what do I, I just give them away as gifts, I guess. It's, I mean, I might get through them maybe, but this one smells amazing. This one is pumpkin spice, caramel toffee and creamy vanilla. It's like a very kind of like cakey, um, yeah, ca cakey caramelly scent and it's very folly. So I had to get that. And then I also got it in, <laughs> there's so many right next to me right now, pumpkin swirl cake as well in the body wash and same scent notes. These were $15.95, but of course I always try to get the sales or like the buy three, get three sales because I don't think it is wise to pay full price. It's like, you know, you just wait a little bit and you'll get a sale. And then of course the mist had to get it the whole set here in the fragrance mist. A fall Bath and Body Works haul would not be complete without some new antibacterials, of course. So I got the sweet to the core antibacterial, very apple-y. This is what I would probably throw in my purse for like, or attach or to hang on my purse because of all the cute little holders I have. Um, <laughs> insane amount of holders I have for like September pumpkin picking or apple picking. And every time you put this on, you just get that like intense burst of that really yummy smell. Also pumpkin pecan waffles, definitely another classic that was necessary. And then sweet as sugar. This was like, I feel like they only, is this going to focus? Brown sugar. Yeah. Brown sugar toasted treat. This is not sweet as sugar. That's the name. Kind of like their classic vanilla scent that I like to have on me. So that has completed my Bath and Body Works Halloween slash fall haul of 2024. But of course I will be probably accumulating more things from there because I'm addicted. It's getting to that time now where I end up posting multiple videos a week because there's so much like stuff coming out in stores, so much stuff I'm accumulating in hauls, you know me. And so I wanna get more stuff out there to you guys and it's super fun so I keep on cranking them out. So if you enjoy this video, it would be so awesome if you gave it a thumbs up. It helps out my channel a ton if you hit the subscribe button to hang out, get more videos. If you made it to the end of this video, can you leave me a little green apple emoji down in the comments to let me know you finished the video? That'll be for this guy because she's beautiful. And I fall in love with inanimate objects all the time. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I love you all. I see your guys' comments and you mean so, so much to me. And I'll see you in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.